Hello, I'm Barbara. Today we're going to paint an easy still life. I will be using the Wacom Intuos tablet and Artridge Light. In Artridge, you can bring up a reference image. That panel is on the right side, just above the color wheel. I'm opening a new image and pinning it right here. I'll start with a sketch and select the pencil tool. I'm using the soft tip preset and picking a nice dark brown. I'm cross-hatching here to indicate the shadows. I'm going to select the pastel tool. I'll be using the soft wax preset to start with. To enhance the effect of the pastel, I'm selecting a rough canvas. Play around with the settings a bit. One advantage of using a reference picture is that you can pick the color right out of the image. If mixing colors seems intimidating, this is a nice way to learn. I'll make a new layer, drag it under the sketch and put some color down. I'll continue to go back to the reference picture, selecting different colors. I'm going to pay special attention to the bow at the top of the apple. It gives us a good opportunity to create depth. I'll pick my own color for the stems and outline. Now we'll add a new layer and switch to a blue for the background as a contrasting color. I'll set my tooltip to 100%. Picking a second shade for the upper edge. For the shadows, I select a dark hue. I'll add some variation to the color here and select a light blue for the background. Tooltip to 200%. Let's turn off our sketch layer here using a small tooltip on a new layer, continue to add detail. Sometimes you can help an object stand out by adding a darker edge. Let's refine a bit more. I'm going to switch between hard and soft wax now to give the finishing touch to each layer. I'll call this done. Hopefully you picked up some new tricks. Thank you so much for watching.